Hey guys, uh, Harry Dog here. This is a little proof of concept video. I'm sorry for the uh, the shaky cam. Uh, poor video and sound quality. I'm recording this on my phone because this PC that you can see in the background here that I usually record my videos on, I'm going to use for the demonstration. So apologies for the uh, poor quality. Uh, but I really wanted to, to show you guys this. So this is my PC, it's running Windows. I'm just going to close it down. Shut down Windows. And yeah, I'm going to demonstrate this uh, little USB drive, uh, bootable USB drive that I've come up with. So it's not a new concept, but let me stick the little USB dongle into the computer, hit the power button. Uh, this is going to take a while to load because obviously it's booting up a, a USB flash drive and not a, an SSD as I, I usually do. So the idea of the concept is a little bit like my Raspberry Pi bare bones image. I was thinking of making a PC version of it essentially a USB flash drive that you can plug into your PC. It'll load up and be set up for the Sindon light gun straight away. So absolutely zero setup. And you could play the Sindon light gun on any PC. So you could take the gun and the USB stick around to a buddy's house and you know play light gun games on, on their PC without having to install the Sindon software. You know, if, if you're like me and you like skiving off work, you could uh, take the USB stick and the Sindon light gun into work, just plug it into your, your work computer. Nobody would know. Uh, so as you can see, this is loading uh, Ubuntu now instead of Windows. There we go. And we booted into the uh, desktop there. So... First thing I'm going to do is load up the Sindon software. So hopefully this would be uh, automated in the final version of the software. Uh, but that's the Sindon software loaded up. And then I'm going to load up RetroArch. Now, I'm quite keen to get standalone emulators working on this. I'm just using RetroArch at the moment because it's easy to set up the whiteboard around the screen. But there we go, we're into RetroArch and I'm going to load up, would you believe it, Duck Hunt. Duck Hunt started up and if everything is working correctly, you can now see me playing Duck Hunt without having to set up anything for the light gun. So, uh, no driver installation, uh, no configuring of emulators, just go straight in and, and play the game. Uh, so this is in a really early stage of development. If anybody's keen on helping me test this, I could really do with testers to, to run the image on uh, their own computers to make sure it's sort of compatible on, on all PCs. Uh, Get me on the Discord. I'll leave a link to the Sindon Discord. You, you can find me on there. Uh, I can give you a, a link to the, the image. Uh, I think it's a really cool concept. Uh, I'm not sure if it's entirely necessary, but if you know people show enough interest in it, I'll, uh, I'll spend some time developing it. And, and yeah, it's, it's a fun little toy. Uh, yeah, and I think that's about it. So, uh, yeah, if, if you've got anything to, uh, to say about it, leave it in the comments, uh, and I'll get back to you. Thank you.